Welcome to a new episode of my Created Club series here with the Espresso Cat Season 4 uh, And yeah, we are here and we are 13 in the league after 11 matches And let's just see how it's going Yeah, as you can see um, Yeah, let's see areas Crawley uh, In the league here Second match, Gillingham and Owen scoring and oh my can't we see match that just disappeared. Very close match, Crawley. Um, we did not have the possession here. Um, as you saw last match, yeah, we might not win the possessioning in every match. And as you can see, yeah, lot of mixed results. But I feel like. We have not really in any match been been really outdone or whatever as you can see. It's one match there against Eckrington which we lost with more than one goal. But again very close match here against Bellaricki. Uh, two goals scored by Owen James really uh, um, yeah, at the time there. And then we had 2-4 uh, against Eckrington uh, at home. Really unfortunate. I feel like we should have at least gotten a draw here, but fortunately we lost here. Then we uh, got a draw against uh, Luton, which was good again because yeah, I don't want to go into like a bad run of form or whatever. So yeah, we uh, had a draw there, nil nil. Pretty close game again, uh, but yeah, I feel like uh, Luton Horn is not bad. Uh, they might be like middle table or whatever. And then Salford, we did, um, I guess we did a decent match. Nothing too uh, brilliant here. Our defense, as you can see, has been a uh, little bit iffy. And O'Reilly, sadly, he's done, uh, Luke O'Reilly has done it good, but he's just no, nor, no Norman in goal there. So yeah, a little bit unfortunate. Uh, I got the draw against Dover. I kind of did not deserve it, but well, uh, they did their own goal there. And we got uh, Michael Parker sent off. He got two yellow cards in about eight minutes, so not great there, but oh well. What can we do? At least we got the draw there, so that was... Good enough. And then we surprisingly, this might be actually the best game of the season so far. We went 3 0 against Wrexham. Wrexham had no shots on target. We scored three goals uh, of five shots on target. So, really effective, really good effectivity there. And Blake, best, as you can see. He's, he's he's still just still just seventy or he's still just sixteen. He's not even seventeen, and he it's just why is he playing the best? It's like he is the best defend, uh, defender, and as well, uh, or I will sh probably showing after all. But horse horse uh, horse fall is a new central defender there. And then we had Ips Fleet away. It's, as I said, we don't get uh, overplayed or anything. Ah, this was this was truly frustrating. We we just got back in the end there, ninety third minute, and of course they scored in the ninety fifth. So no points to us there. And then Hartlepool away. We have not been brilliant away, but. Finally, we won away as well. Uh, Barnett uh, got one of his first matches of the season. He's been pretty good in the youth teams. I thought, why not actually start him? And, and he got the 9.0 there. The okay, best player. And uh, Don Maldini as well doing it great there. Nicely, we won there against Hartley Pool. And then we got to draw against uh, Barrow. Uh, yeah, but... Will Hatfield scoring the first goal there very late, and then they did their equalization. I feel like it was deserved. 
so yeah and uh, Barlow I believe surprisingly they are pre they are second so I'm still pretty happy with that result and so we have uh, six points down to relegation but hopefully that will not be a problem as you saw we will play against uh, Geisley which is surprisingly a playoff team I believe yeah the season expectation they were expected in the bottom there so and Haruga were expecting as the best team from the Gansley or Leeds area whatever I think it was some reason why I was selling him I don't know might just be him yeah I think that is his high wages here and oh yeah that that's why I'm thinking of selling him as well we are trying to get Jordan Murphy in from Teleford. He was top goal scorer in uh, Van Rama North two years ago. And scored last season 26 goals. So, so yeah, and we have just signed one player. And it's Fraser Horsfall, as you saw there. He's played pretty good so far. He... I mostly assigned him because he's done pretty good there for Gunsley and um, yeah he did not cost that much either and and his wages was not too much either so a decent backup there and Rob Atkinson is getting older and Sam Carfright I feel like he's not good enough for uh, central defenders so yeah, we can still improve uh, right, right defender, left defender there, and defensive mid goalkeeper. So it's still some room for improvement. But I think this season we will most likely just be uh, a middle team. So yeah, Johnny Maldini, uh, free assist there, and then Ryan Barnett has been really good. Even if it's not played too much and Matthew Gillam has not been as good as last season but still still scoring the goals even if it's a high link so yeah so we will uh, start up like this today uh, O'Reilly Richardson uh, Callum William okay he's better there uh, uh, Callum Williams Horsfell uh, Black Blackshaw, uh, Davis, let's call what he's called, this young snow, uh, Stephen Davis, score one of the goals there, Hatfield, Barnett, uh, Jacob Ramsey, because I like him to be more match fit, and Donovan Maldini has been very inconsistent as well, we have only loan him and uh, uh, we have loaned Ramsey as well but I believe it, we have more potential to actually get Ramsey and he has I feel yeah he's younger as well and I'm pretty sure that he has more potential as well and then uh, Owen James and Gillingham up top and this is a home match still we're very inconsistent Harrogate will be away and then the next match will probably be in the FA Cup. I was thinking about that. It, it depends a little bit, but mostly of these, we're actually, as you can see, and most the, most of these matches have been really tough. Rex and Dover, as you can see, and Salford, uh, Luton, and yeah, some of this team that also been like impressively good like Barrow and uh, but we have mostly teams there on the bottom half so I think we will just go through I think it, it is the fifth so this Maidstone match will probably be postponed we will um, play the FA Cup second round hopefully we will get there I guess we will see if we get the good team there but I saw that we got to meet Chesterfield, I feel like. Or the first season it was. Or suit suit on some you we probably be able to do that, but I feel like doing the third is a little bit late and I 
I think, unfortunately, there isn't any two interesting matches, like I said. Um, and yeah, Black Show is not really uh, match fit, so that's why I also wanted to play him there instead of Blake. Blake is actually being better. Um, or bl I would not say Black Show is bad, he's just not been that impressive and a little bit inconsistent. Or Yes, he's not done. Or he's not played that many matches, that's just it. Uh, I sadly feel like... Um, Woodcock, who we uh, took in f uh, for this season, that would be the best left back, has sadly not been it, so... <laughs> this is why, actually, why Blake have gotten more matches than I thought. I thought they wouldn't be... As good uh, here in the Venerama National, but it seems like it doesn't matter. He's just play with a lot of confidence, so it doesn't even matter if his stats kind of sucks, to be fair, or he's just sort of mediocre or boring. It's always interesting. Hopefully, we can go on a long cup run at least, but it might not be super exciting. And it's a little bit worrisome. Or our economics is pretty decent, as you could see there. And we had a lot of transfer budget, but it's still. Yeah, I don't know. We we need to get some players out, maybe, just because they aren't good enough. It's sort of getting a little bit, maybe too big of a squad. Oh, Callum Morrison. But as long as we don't go into any... It seems like we're winning a match, then we're losing a match, then we're drawing and... I mean, I do not mind. As long as we don't get down to the relegation battle here. So after all, four teams don't go down, so we need to be better than four other teams. I feel we... Okay, we m might not have the best squad depth or whatever, but I feel some of the players are definitely good enough for Van Rama North. Oh, Malern. Yeah. We're just not good enough for uh, this season's Gunslade. It's exciting that Gunslade might be playing League 2. I don't know how it's working because seeing their team, they have not really like improved it so much that it makes sense for them to go better now. Jacob Ramsey there assisting to Owen James. I believe he scored six goals now, so or maybe I, sh I maybe I shouldn't even bring in even if it said that uh, Murphy there was. The best, um, or he was um, had potential for League Two, but I mean, if Owen James just keeps scoring like this, there's no reason to really sell him. I I don't understand why he's playing better in a higher league than he did last season. He's just one handily got us back in this match. Yes, Hatfield and. Uh, Ramp has done pretty good, but defensively we have not been <laughs> not been great today. I would say also that we are not the best defensive team in the league either. So, and I've seen actually the Tarot Gate. They were bottom before bottom of the league, so they are getting better and better. So a little bit worrisome. So hopefully we can at least keep this draw. Would be very happy then. Sadly, the, the unfortunate thing, as you can see, the Barnet's playing really good. Gillingham, Owen J. Oh, no. Okay, never, no, not the goal there. But uh, sadly, with uh, Barn, Barnet, he's not playing bad, but his uh, fitness, I believe, his. What is it called here? Stamina. Oh, it's, it's actually gone up, but still looking at the stats, it's kind of. Not really the best, even if I sort of play them now in 
three matches in a row from start, he's still as one of those players that were really bad uh, match fitness here, so that's a little bit unfortunate. Um, as you can see, some of the players are not really fit here. Uh, Webb Foster, was he injured? He might have been. No? He's just not playing. That's strange. I don't understand why I did that. Why I did not even start with him in the match. But oh well. He looked a little bit tired. So let's get him out there. Hopefully we can create something here in the second half. I've been pretty effective. Or I don't know. Maybe. I feel like it's guns have had more of the balls. So we have not seen that many chances, but now I saw there that is actually similar. Uh, ooh, would work. That is a little bit scary there. Uh, so Abstreet and Actrington seems to be in the top teams there. Still, I like this. Possessionally, we have not been outplayed by any team, really. Uh, we are about the same. It's 50-50, so... so At least technically, we are as good as every other team in the league. As you feel like, just defensively, sadly, we are not that good. And especially not losing our first... Uh, what is this called? Yeah, our starting goalkeeper, and uh, we lost our best central defender. We lost uh, uh, one of our right backs, Christian Maldini. Yeah, he was not that great, though, but it was still. Ooh, Elliot Watt uh, is doing a brilliant substitution here and scoring 3 2 to us. And we have turned around this and. Davis with a beautiful, or beautiful, it was not that. Ramsey almost <laughs> got struck down there. So I don't know, it might be a little bit longer because so now they are on 20 minutes or whatever. So Blackshaw is not going to play the full match. Hope, hopefully, it would cut, cock would not cock it up. Or fuck it up. <laughs> uh, I don't know. That was his bad pun. So yeah, Harrogate is as well proving there. So that's that's fun. If more teams from the Leeds area are oh, it's called something. I can't I don't wanna that area it's called something but uh spe special the region or the the parts of the country school. Okay, would no, don't don't fuck it up, I said. Don't freaking fuck this up. Hurst, oh, I'm worried. We probably will concede the third here. I mean, we are the espresso cats after one, so we will concede a lot of goals. As you can see, our, our goal difference three, so it's not brilliant still. But oh well, at least we have a draw so far. Uh, East Web Foster, we will get in here in the end of the match. Man, what are you doing, Williams? It's your fault that we're losing now. I can't say anything else than it's your fucking fault they're losing. I know you have bad uh, pace, but this is just ridiculous. I mean, you... You just missed the ball there. It's like you have no fucking ball control whatsoever. Well. So yeah, I would probably stop and be right back for the second game then. Uh, not another goal there. Okay, there was the game. At least we stand up pretty good in the derby here against Ga Geisley. So Hierogate is next, so see you soon again. Hello, and we are back here and uh, ready for the next match. And we've done some changes um, in the <laughs> defensive areas. Uh, it might, 
though it might have been my mistake why we conceded four we or we played it or i guess it i it I don't know if it makes so much difference since it was still uh Geisley to uh Geisley being yep in the playoff there and us uh, our form being inconsistent so I'm not sure it would have made so much difference but well at least here we'll play uh, start with a way take and, and do it good so O'Reilly in goal reaches on sadly we don't have another a right back that's good enough cough right He's not good enough for this level. He's not improved enough or whatever. Fielding and Parker and uh, now in the middle there. I wish at but Atkinson as well have not played good enough when he got the new chance. Blake uh, to the left there. Davis, Gregory, Watts. What did score in the last match? So hopefully that will be uh, I'm resting or it might actually be better, so we will put Gregors in the on the bench there. So Hatfield and Watt, John Maldini and Owen James and Gillingham. Because why actually change the uh, strike partnerships uh, when actually yeah Owen James scored their two goals and I decided to not bring in what is he call uh, I will play two D here for the second game. Uh, I mean, why why change? We actually scored eight goals in the league and is our top scorer right now. So I'm not going to sell him. He just have two stars. He's still like our fourth or it might even be fifth best striker. Uh, at least the uh, coach says that. Oh, great. Yep. Oh, boop, boop. Uh, that would have been a brilliant start to concede a goal after like four minutes, but luckily it wasn't to be there. Uh, so seven points up. Oh, I guess we. No, we are not. We are not going to focus at uh, just going up. No, we are going to focus at not getting relegated because now we have five points down. Would at least get uh, like to get a draw here. Sture go out. Gillingham. Ooh. Close. Close there, but not good enough. At least we had the chance. But we're uh, I believe we were expected on like 18 or 16 plays, so basically doing what is expected of us in the league. Uh but oh I don't I don't like to lose both of these matches. It's just and, oh, Riley. Riley is doing the job. It's just, it's not. <laughs> I I feel like Norman. I can't even remember his fur uh, surname here. But Norman, he he could win matches for us. I don't feel like O'Reilly can win. Ah, oh. ah, oh, that 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 was just luckily. Oh my god, Michael Parker. You're doing the same fucking thing as Callum did. What's it called? Callum w uh, Willis. Buttersworth. What the freaking name is that? And what? What? I guess it would be a sad times here. And we will get worried. But still, there's nine points at the. Uh, Fourth team down there. It might be like that. that we're going to still be shitty, but not not shit enough to get relegated. So at least that is what I'm hoping. It really is like that in the lower league. You, you can't expect a player to do two good matches in a row. It's it's it doesn't work that way. Is, yeah, but probably going to put them on the bench in the next <laughs> in the next match, and then he's going to score when he comes in because that is just typical. And oh, yeah, Owen James terrible today. Not done anything so far. Or uh, no, he's playing as a poacher, so that's not the problem.
I shouldn't say that you have been good. You have been shit. That's probably better to say. You've been shit. Oh, all right. We're six, 60 minutes in and it's 30 minutes left. <laughs> I feel like we've not even been in this match, to be fair. This might be one of our worst matches. At least in the... That, that, that's the best chance so far in the 66th minute. Team shot by the Hatfield. Blake at least wins the header there. Masonqua. Masonqua has been better, you know, than Owen James. Gregory Hatfield. Gillingham! Oh. It's just, it's just not our day because we even hit the crossbar there, of course. For mid football match, it's just so OP, I feel like. But so f ah, I'm still worried. I'm still worried that we now will go, go into a long patch of bad form. Can we at least score a goal here? Something positive to take uh, in for the next match. Maldini, Masonqua, Maldini, Gilliam. Can you fucking score? No. Masonqua, do we get... Yes! Masonqua, I don't know what happened there, but at least it is a goal, so that's that's something. Can we If we can get the draw then I am Okay, it's been a shit show so far today, but at least then I'm happy. At least we need to come back then. Now then Masonqua Maldini Ugh. It's too sloppy passings as well. Sloppy defending, slo everything just. We don't even get this last chance here. Well, the only thing I, uh, I feel, like I said, again, we are not, we're not losing like 5 nil, and that would be even more disappointing, but as you can see, lot of red still, so. And uh, Manchel Field is in the mid, so hopefully we can... Uh, it's still a wait, so I don't know. But I mean, we won against Wrexham, so you never know. That was a match that I didn't thought we would win. They were terrible, so... Yeah, thank you for watching. Have a good tea and a good coffee day. And I see you soon again, so... Bye!